Hey, Sangrius from the Hidden Levels here. Um, here to preview a little bit of a new game called Blues and Blats. This is an episodic game, five parter. Um, this is I'm showing you a little bit of the episode one. Uh, at the time of the recording, only the first episode is out, but um, you know, uh, it's enough to show you how the game plays and what it looks like. So let's get started. Um, the blues and bullets refers to blues kind of refers to the police as the main character is a cop used to be a cop now a restaurant owner um, but the game is very 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 story driven as you might imagine from the episodic nature and it's the style is um, like uh, 1930s or uh, 40s that's I believe that's where the game is set like in the 20s or 30s where we ha we still have like Russian mafias in our midst in US and things like that so uh, I'm gonna try not to spoil any story for you but um, if you are spoiled this is the first episode's first chapter so it's like the first five minutes of the game I, I do not show any other parts of the game just on purpose because the uh, na the way the game is played and or and the graphic style it never changes uh, as you as the episode goes on uh, so that I don't really spoil anything for you guys uh, this is a very well written story with the uh, nice voice acting and all that uh, so uh, we're just looking at the kind of the opening cinematic sequence here uh, unfortunately <laughs> even if you wanted to replay the game there is no way to skip uh, dialogues that I found so that's kind of the unfortunate thing but uh, usually because it's very story driven and you know what the story is like not really much of a replay value uh, if you're if you're wondering how long it takes to finish an episode it's about an hour and a half to two hours depending on how, s how fast or slow you take it uh, now we are starting the game we're controlling this uh, little girl character she's uh, locked in a cell and the way the game is played you go you use the left stick to move the character and go near where the red eye shows up and press A to interact there's nothing else there's no inventory there's no nothing like that that uh, the only different game mechanism that I do not show on this video that happens is kind of an FPS FPS style or TPS style gameplay where you're uh, hiding behind the cover and you have to press LT to aim down your sight and press RT to kill the enemies but it's super easy it's uh, there's nothing <laughs> Um, it's nothing like a real third-person shooter or anything like that you just pop out there's n there's not even a reload or ammo count or anything like that you just pop out shoot some people uh, hide back and all that and so it's not really a much of a departure per se uh, if you're worried about achievements, it's super easy. All of the achievements are story based except for one, which is for interacting with everything. A lot of the stuff that you, you uh, can interact with are I'm very far away, and you see that uh, eye. Just go towards the eye, it's usually very easy to see. There's a few that you might miss if you're not careful about things, but you can always do a scene select and uh, finish off everything you missed uh, be aware that you do have to finish the scene to get the achievement and the uh, tracker that shows the percentage goes up only after you finish each scene so um, the stuff that I show in this video are the entire first episode and every single uh, interaction possible is done so if you are following this video um, and you, you got everything in at least scene one. Um, 
<clears throat> it doesn't matter which uh, choice you make you can choose you can try to open up the boy's cage or you can just go for the exit either way I believe the guy comes in and you have to hide and th there's not really much you can do and um, it doesn't show but something happens to the girl and I believe she is related to the uh, the actual main character that I talked about the ex-cop that's a restaurant owner now uh, anyway that's pretty much all of blues and bullets we're, com we're coming close to the end of the scene one here uh, it ends with the guy uh, like is doing that thing with the knife and opening up the closet I believe so that's that and um, my name is Sangrius from the hidden levels this is Bulls and Bullets uh, episodic game on Xbox one uh, I, I hope you know you check this out if you like episodic story driven games and don't forget to hit the subscribe button on our youtube channel and thank you for watching i'll be back with more previews and walkthroughs